This lesson provides a high-level explanation of your ServiceLive dashboard. After you've completed your provider firm profile and at least one Service Pro profile, you will see this dashboard view when you log in. For more information, see the Registration, Firm Profile, and Provider Profile lessons. Toward the top of the screen, we see some tabs. The Dashboard tab is active. This is where we are now. Service Order Monitor. Here you can sort and filter orders, as well as utilize two additional tabs, Inactive and Search. Service Live Wallet. Here you can manage your wallet funds. You may view your wallet balance from here on the dashboard. For more information, see the Service Live Wallet lessons. Order Management. Here you'll manage your service orders as they progress through the lifecycle. For more information, see the Order Management lessons. If you are part of the Leads program, you may also see a Leads Management tab. On the right side is the Administrator Office tab. Here you can manage firm and service provider profiles, view SPN membership statuses, access W9 information, and manage settings for auto-routed orders. Now let's look at the Service Order Statistics section. This section gives you an overview of all orders your company currently has available. Today, these are service orders that have an active service window. This could be orders to complete today or orders that are completed but still need a status update. Accepted. All orders that have been accepted by the entire company. Pending cancel. Orders that need to be canceled and need action on your part. Received. All orders sent to the company that are awaiting action. Bid requests. Typically larger commercial jobs that require a site visit and a submission for the price of parts and labor to complete the job. Pending reschedule. Orders that need to have the service window updated and need action on your part. Problem. These are typically orders that you have reported an issue with that are awaiting a resolution from the buyer. Right below Service Order Statistics, you'll see Communication Monitor. This is where you will find any new invitations to join select provider networks or SPNs. Here you are able to see which buyer is sending the invitation, as well as the date it was sent and the date that it expires. You can manage your service orders on the go with the Service Live Pro mobile app. Learn more by clicking here or view our mobile app lessons. Now let's look at the left side of your dashboard. At the top is the Performance and Profile Statistics section. This shows how your company is being rated by your customers. Beneath that is the Service Live Status Monitor. Here you'll see your firm's registration status. Approved means that you have completed registration and are eligible to receive work through the Service Live platform. Provider registration status tells you how many of your technicians have completed their profiles. Provider background checks list the statuses of all technician background checks. Service Live Leads is the pay-per-lead way to build your residential business. We are currently handling out-of-warranty home appliance leads the majority of the time. If you are interested in finding out more about Service Live Leads, click the Sign Up link in the title bar or the Sign Up button. Member offers change from time to time. To view available discounts and services offered to you as a Service Live provider, click the More link in the title bar or the graphic. Lastly is the SPN Monitor section. SPN stands for Select Provider Network. SPNs allow you to join a select membership that will distinguish you from the competition within your market. For more information, 
see the SPN lessons. Here you can see the status of each SPN membership. SPN memberships must be in a member status to receive available work from that buyer. Clicking the View link in the title bar will take you to the SPN Monitor tab. You can also get there by hovering over the Administrator Office tab and selecting SPN Monitor. In this lesson, you learned how to navigate your ServiceLive dashboard.